I have a new type of person that I'm into now because of the pandemic. Yeah, I'm into doomsday preppers. <laughs> yeah. Remember when we thought doomsday preppers were just cuckoo pants weirdos? Like, look at this freak. He's digging an underground bunker. <laughs> and then COVID happened and we had the great toilet paper crisis. <laughs> and now I'm like, yeah. Climb into this bunker, baby. <laughs> now I'm on Tinder. If you don't have 30 cases of beans in your basement, swipe left, asshole. <laughs> no 2,000 pack of mac and cheese, keep it moving. I want someone who's thinking long term. Because <laughs> the toilet paper shortage was the scariest part of the pandemic, right? I mean, people were literally getting into fist fights at Target over toilet paper, which says so much about how spoiled we are as Americans. Like, none of us thought we were gonna starve to death, but crusty asshole, oh, that, that was a fear. That was a real fear. Like, the supermarkets never ran out of food. They always had food. The only things they were out of were cleaning supplies and TP. My parents thought this was the most ridiculous thing. My parents both survived almost starving to death in the middle of the Korean War. So they were like, what's with the toilet paper? <laughs> Do people know that if you shit in your house, you can just jump in the tub <laughs> and wash your asshole? I'm like, whoa, 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 mom and dad. We are not a third world country. <laughs> we don't wash our butts. Are you crazy? No, we get into fist fights at Target like civilized people. <laughs> I totally got caught up in it. I got caught up in the TP panic. I was down to my last roll of Charmin and I freaked out. I drove down to the hood. I trekked down to like little Guatemala and I found a tiny little bodega and they had toilet paper. But you know what? It was in Espanol. See. I snatched up Quatros Rolos de Papel Hygienico. And I learned something very interesting about Spanish language toilet paper. A lot of the times, it's scented. Right at the top of my Quatros Rolos, right at the top it says, Aroma de Manzanilla. <laughs> which I Google translated, it means scent of chamomile. <laughs> I had bought chamomile flavored toilet paper, which was disappointing because my asshole prefers a nice Earl Grey. <laughs> Cause it was so stressful. The pandemic was so stressful. I was grinding my teeth so badly and I learned how bad it had gotten when I finally made my way back to the dentist. My dentist, by the way, is a 70 year old Palestinian man. So he's seen some shit. <laughs> and he's like, oh. <sighs> Helen. <laughs> Helen, Helen, Helen. You are grinding your teeth. Grinding, 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 grinding. I can tell because your jaw muscles are huge. <laughs> Guys, I'm jacked in the face. <laughs> of all the muscle groups that I wish were ripped on my body, not my abs, not my biceps, no, I have a yoked head. 